This is Chris Kelly with the standard plank progression that we utilize uh, with our clients before adding motion. All right, our first progression begins with simply holding in a plank for 10 to 30 seconds. All right, after doing so, we're going to come into a bent leg side plank. All right, I'm just bending my knees here. I'm only raising from the waist. Again, the goal here is to hold steady, making sure the torso stays at around 90 degrees without sagging or piking up into the air. All right, from here, I'm simply going to come over, hold in this position for the prescribed time. Now, once the client can hold in those three positions for 30 seconds, we're just going to add a little bit of difficulty to the exercise by elevating the feet on a box during the plank. Once again, what I'm looking for with this, keeping the abs tight, not dipping or driving up, and holding steady for 20 to 30 seconds. Moving off the box, I'm just going to straighten my legs out here. You can also stack the uh, top foot in front to uh, lower the pressure just a little bit. But again, the main thing here is you're holding in this steady position for 10 to 30 seconds, switching sides. Okay, now in our last progression, what we're going to do for the plank is move back down to the floor and simply raise one leg off the ground. With this, we're going to hold from either anywhere from 10 to 15 seconds on each side. Okay, just switching, then moving in to a elevated side plank here. I've got my feet up on a box, makes the uh, angle of resistance a little steeper, makes it a little bit harder, just holding in this position, turning over, and holding. Okay, now that is our standard plank progression. Once the client can get to level three for 30 seconds in each uh, position, we're going to incorporate motion as we're going to show you in the next couple videos.